Uh, hi, my name is Robert Gall and I have traveled all the way from Sweden to Garmisch in Germany just to witness this event with BMW. Uh, you can't buy the tires at the shop, but you can buy studs if you want to, it's for ice racing. But the tires we use, it's my father who builds them and uh, yeah, it's make it more personal and uh, I trust them more than the studs that you can buy. So. Uh, it all started when I was looking for sponsors and I thought that I need to do something special just to get the attention. So I started to search online for crazy ideas and I found an American that had done a wheelie on ice. And yeah, I thought we could beat it so that's how I came up with it. So uh, when I was young, my father rode motorcycles and he inspired me to do it as well. He imported pocket bikes to Sweden and that's the way I started. So. Doing wheelies on ice is one thing and doing it on sand or something else, I'm not sure if it's possible but uh, I'm open for suggestions and I might try something else. Yes, it's possible, but I can't. I don't. Uh, I haven't practiced so much yet. Uh, my biggest wheel wobble is when I set down a super motored wheelie. Uh, I was turning a bit when I still was in the wheelie and set the front tire down, and then the whole bike uh, was shaking. If I would have been a motorcycle, I probably would, would have been the, the XR because it's uh, fast but still stable and it's an adventure to ride it and that's uh, what my life is like. I think I am better to do wheelies than stoppies at the moment but I will practice the stoppies and uh, hopefully get better with the stoppies too. Well, I'm uh, pretty short, uh, but uh, I can fit uh, onto any bike, I think. So yes, uh, 450 Supermoto, I'm, it's okay for me. <laughs> I can't count all the crashes I have made, it's too many, but only two of them have been serious. And it has been on the racetrack, so still the ambulance, ambulance have been fast to help me. Uh, we are planning some new challenges, but I can't let you know what it is yet. I think if you want to start riding, then you already feel it, so I can't tell you if you like it or not. You just have to try it, but I think you will like it. So, my favorite bike is a double R because it's really fast and I have some great memories with it. Uh, while riding on the ice to break the Guinness World Record, I have never crashed. And uh, if we try again, I hope I won't crash either. I don't have any special regrets. Uh, I just uh, take every, every opportunity I get to make the best out of it. Yeah, no regrets. I started to ride pocket bikes when I was five years old and moved on to 1.5cc when I was 12. Yeah, as I have said before, my father has inspired me a lot. Uh, we are always having fun together and uh, yeah, when I was younger he was riding and uh, all I could see was him, so yeah. Uh, to ride on the ice, uh, all the ideas come from the internet, basically. I wasn't the first one, I just have seen others do it, so I thought it looked cool and I wanted to try it too. If you want to learn to ride a bike, my suggestion would be to first sit behind and feel how the rider rides it and uh, when it's your turn yeah keep the more experienced rider behind you so he can maybe hold the bar with you and help you to ride it the first time so you will get the feeling 
First we had to build tires and go out and test them. And uh, the first time it didn't work and uh, the second time it didn't work and uh, yeah, multiple times it didn't work. So we have built a lot of tires.